Damon Carmabalo, often known as the GOAT to Call of Duty esports fans, has seen success like no other. Oh my god! Ridiculous! What have we just seen? <laughs> With three world championships under his belt, the only player to do so, it's fair to say he's had some incredible moments in his career. This is the karma we know and love. We're here to look at the top 10 karma moments from before Black Ops 4. Opening at number 10 is his 1v4 ace at the Crown Melbourne Invitational against Tainted Minds in 2016. Marking an incredibly quick round of search and destroy on fringe, Karma found two enemies across mid-map with the M8A7 before rounding back towards the bomb and finding the remaining two enemies. He's captain on the squad, he's the one who fires him up, he needs to start, but Karma with two straight away. That's pretty rough for the boys here, and he gets a third. Karma goes for four! That was probably the fastest ace I've ever seen. A 1v4 ace is usually a pretty remarkable feat, but Karma made this look like a piece of cake. At number 9 is his Tempest plays on fringe hardpoint during the CWL Stage 1 Finals of Black Ops 3. Facing off against Team Solo mid, and with a healthy lead, Karma pulled out the Tempest Specialist to clear the objective, picking up 5 kills of the weapon before finally being downed. All right, well now let's go on with TSM for a little bit here and see if they can hold down tracks because they are getting blown off the map right now. You see Karma coming in right now with the Tempest, gets two, that's going to chain, he might get all three, is it going to spread? Oh, there it is, get the two in the back, get the four shot, hit the shot, please, Damon! The series saw all seven maps played out, but Karma's Tempest plays in the opening map set the tone for Optic's eventual series and tournament win. In at number 8 is Karma's sneak defuse against Unite on Meltdown Search and Destroy at Gfinity 2. This is one of those clips that's become famous in the Call of Duty community, with Karma finding himself in a 1v3 situation and pulling off the sneak defuse, something not many would have had the gall to do. Please, please, pl <gasps> no. <laughs> no! Karma! Karma, please do it to him. Please do it to him. Please do it to him. There's three of them. They're all inside the generator. Karma, go for the ninja defuse. 45% of the way through. No one's checking up. Karma, yes! I get the ninja defuse! Oh my Karma! Ridiculous. What have we just seen? The confidence. The confidence to do that at this stage in the tournament. This is absolutely unreal. Look at the crowd reaction. Karma is going to let everybody know about that. That was a ridiculously reckless rush from MV. Black Ops 2 has gone down almost unanimously as the greatest title COD Esports has had to date, and Karma's play here to steer Team Envy to victory is one that most fans will never forget. Number 7 is Karma clutching a 1v3 against Kingsman at the MLG Orlando Open in 2016. In the seventh round of the final map of the series, Kingsman took down all of Karma's Optic teammates and planted the bomb, leaving him to find and kill all three with time left to defuse. Of course, such scenarios are no issue for Karma, who hastily took down two before making a sneaky play around the trees to assassinate the third. Looks like they will favor this A bomb site. But I think uh, Karma has spotted one. Yeah. Oh, this could just work out so perfectly. Yeah, I don't think so. This could work out so perfectly. Tristic challenges. Llama gets the better of him though, and that might just be the dagger. Objective will be planted. Karma in the one v one v three. It's going to be a really tough one v three if you want to pull this off. He, uh, he's going to get spotted. I do not think he has any hope here. Maybe. Oh, heat wave, heat wave. He has heat wave. This is possible now. Please, please, my heart, my heart. One, I can't three. handle this. Parasite. Parasite doesn't spot him. I don't, I don't know. If, I don't know. If, I don't know if they have any idea what's going on. Be Parasite now. On the other Oh my the God! Wave. Oh, and he's he's Karma. keeping the bags. Just pulled it's off the team. impossible. Bodies were shot, and once again, Karma led his team to victory. At number six, he continues to do the impossible with a 1v3 using only a pistol against Millennium at DreamHack Valencia. Playing alongside a European team, Karma had to make every effort to prevent Millennium planting the bomb, and he did so valiantly. Oh, it's definitely bold with Karma. Yeah, Here's one versus three. God, Karma. Oh, 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 Karma. Oh, Karma. God, what has Karma just done? Fantastically well played, he needs to stay alive. Oh, 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 oh my God! Karma. Oh my God! One versus three from Karma, and you should have seen him <laughs> explode out of his seat. Muxi walks away from the table. You can't believe he's just what he's just seen. Just ridiculous <laughs> play right there. Number 5 on our list is Karma once again facing TSM on fringe hardpoint in the CWL Stage 1 Finals. Indeed, 
In the very same match as number 9, Karma goes on a 10 kill streak, including another incredible use of the Tempest Specialist. This streak secured the map for Optic Gaming. Do they have what it takes to do it now? Still trailing by a wide margin, but the comeback seems to be a glimmer of hope until you get all four down for TSM Optic so, regaining the to, control. That's the easiest way to stop a comeback. Uh, yeah, that's, that's TSM, one solid way. They're gaining momentum. You, they set up in the mid, and you see Karma yet again with the oh. Tempest, able to pick up three. Big kills, gets fully streaked out again, and if you are a oh, player come, not uh, watching... Don't run to him! What? Just leave him alone! If you are a player not watching what the Tempest does and don't think about going Tempest over Annihilator, I think you're crazy, personally. Well, I mean, that was a 10 streak for Karma, You see man. how many kills you can pick up with the Tempest. Optic won the CWL Stage 1 Finals, but without Karma popping off in this opening match against TSM, we may have seen a very different set of results. Number four, Karma is a player that doesn't falter on the biggest stage, and he proved this once again at MLG Atlanta 2017, when he went on an 11 kill streak against E United on Retaliation Hardpoint, including an impressive turn on on Prestini for the 10th. He played the objective perfectly, his movement second to none, as he continuously gunned down any E United player that dared get near him. They do a good job holding either side of the street. Inside, though, it's Karma with two big ones the two-time champ breaks in no one seems to be able to hold any kind of control for very long here yeah i mean it's good plays by both teams it just does not work out in their favor you see one player coming across the bridge on the minimap right here to challenge karma he's able to win that as well currently on a four streak karma has actually played really big in the respawn game modes in the last two series from optic i've seen and he didn't have the best friday and saturday some off games but today he's been lights out as he continues to go there's the six 25 off the bombardment Damon Barlow looking to get set up here with full streaks, and there's a little Humpty Dumpty. The bags are out. So you see it's going to be United going to that hotel hallway. Fantastic plays by Karma, able to lock that down for Optic Gaming. And they're a scary team. When he gets going, they're going to be very difficult to beat because you know at least Formal and Scump are going to play well. Formal starting to come back a little bit, having a really slow start to this game. But the snapper, Karma, man. The, the snapper. Oh. Eight in a row. Fully streaked out, 15 and 6 is Karma, as he is manhandling E United. And, and you looked at this team coming in, you know, Optic Gaming, you know, where could you take advantage of them? Karma has some off games playing in this role, you know, in Optic Gaming where he just does not have the luxury of being a top flight slayer. Not happening right now, 9 in a row for Karma. He can do no wrong, and now doubling up their opponents, turning, burning, get out of my house, Pristini now gone. This is insane. This is vintage karma. And yeah, we have not seen this karma in a very long time. It's good to see him perform well on the main stage. And now you can start to hear the fans. The let's go off the chance coming in as karma is still on a roll. Finally going to get cut down at 11 on the streak. Number three on our list is Karma turning on Nadeshot at the Call of Duty Championships 2014 US Regional Qualifiers. Having found himself in a 1v3 situation, the fact that Karma clutched up is often lost on viewers, who remember the clip most fondly for turning on Nadeshot, who was simply not prepared for the fire that Karma rained down on him. There'll be no one right in front of him, pressure's on. He's currently dealing with a 1v3 placer, Nadeshot and Scump, and Nadeshot's playing out of his mind, 6-0 yep. here. Definitely showing up on Search and Destroy. Karma looking around, seeing if he can get it. Oh, he's angle. just going straight past someone. He yeah. actually had his crosshair over a player there and, and didn't see him, so he's going to have to track back. Now decides to try and pick up that bomb. I mean, 40 seconds left in a one versus three. It's not looking good. And as well, Clayster still yet to die. But it looks like now Karma is this. He's on the left hand side. Ooh. Get Scump. That's a good start now with 30 seconds left in one versus two. This is looking a, a little bit better for Karma, although if he can find this second kill, it really is going to help his his cause because he can only really afford to go towards that B site in terms of time. 20 seconds, it is ticking away, and Optic oh! this, but they have to kill on Karma. Oh, Karma. Picks up place, and now it's a one versus one. Karma versus Nadeshot. Nadeshot still yet to die. Six and oh. Karma, is he going to go for the plan? Is he going to bait it out? Looks like he's going to go for it now. Is Nadeshot going to challenge? He's going to need to, otherwise the plan is going to go Done. down. Oh no, right oh. behind him. Yes, oh, Karma, the shot. Oh, oh my no! God, my Karma. Karma just destroyed Nadeshot! It's simple. You do not make mistakes against Karma because he will take full advantage. Coming in at number two, we've got another 1v3 clutch against Kingsman at the MLG Orlando Open 2016. The round ended up being the decider for the series as Karma calmly took down Miracles and Llama before a cat and mouse chase with Morks, who was no match for Karma's veteran mind games and ability. The rookie cracked, and Karma once again came out on top. I want to go to the round 11. 
Scum's gonna charge now, it. Yeah. And then a cop. There it is. There's one. Second comes oh. in. Heat wave is the counter. Lama cuts him down. Karma 1v2. Not again. Sees one. Cuts him down. Oh, no. One versus one. This is for everything. Another 1v3 opportunity for Karma. 28 seconds left. Mox does have active camo. He's gonna blind pop it, and you hate this type of oh. And he gives position. Oh, talk about panicking on the main stage. 1v1. Karma. Mox. Everything on the line. Karma peeks out. He oh gets the God. kill. Karma, you're the best Karma ever. Is Two a rings. Piece. Two rings. Karma acts cool, calm, and collected. Formal gives him the high five. It's two 1v3s as Optic Gaming win it in game five. What did we just see? This leaves us with number one, Karma's greatest moment from before Black Ops 4. Of course, it has to be the longest killstreak ever seen before at a professional event, as Karma went unchallenged for 28 straight kills against Team Enigma at Gfinity 2. And here comes the score streaks, and he doesn't manage to dodge any of this. Oh, Karma boy. picks up three. Just all of Enigma shut down there, nothing they can do, and now they've been pushed completely out of the half point. And look at Karma, he knew where the spawn was going to be, throws in early Semtex, taking fire from the church, still survives it, puts pressure on that player. They're going to leave just Rambo up top in the hard point, but they're going to be happy to give up these last 23 seconds. They're up 76 to 30. And Karma takes down one in the hill, and he takes down two in the hill, and now Black has to try and do something. He's changed it around, but they're still in there. Karma picking up another kill. The man is going off. He's on a nine streak at the moment, and somebody stop him. This is the Karma we know and love in the double digits now on this streak. Fully streaked out. War Machine in hand, but he knows there's going to be Flak Jackets heading his way. They have one player watching the window. Karma was watching the side door. The window man goes down, but Karma deals with it. <laughs> Easy pick as he's going to take down Luke for his 11th kill in this spree. Take a look at the scoreboard. 18 and 5 from Karma to open things up. Karma is going to come through, and it's just going to allow Envy to just push through and do what they like. However, Sour's answers back with a double kill, but Karma comes right back, and he's just breaking them apart. Yeah, Karma with another perfect rotation takes out Black. The Hellstorm going to do damage here, forcing players into purple. Unfortunately, takes out his teammate Ray, but Ray wasn't anywhere near that hard point quite yet. Gets a preferred spawn up top, and I like this this play from Karma. He's not going to challenge from the top as expected. He's going to try and push in from the window with the War Machine. Doesn't connect on the first one. Switches out for the Scorpion, and here comes the damage. Karma <laughs> on a 15, make it 16 kill spree. Going huge for Envy, showing that he is still wanting to be considered the best player in Black Ops 2. That is a ridiculous guy. You cannot allow a guy to go on a 70s, 18 kill streak. What is he? That is, is he, he's doubled up on the War Machine. Doubled up on the War Machine, going for all the kills with his weapons. Very few kills. Oh no, he's from about to he's about to double up. He's double up on the lightning strike and, and everything there it else. Is. Fully there we go. out, doubling up, dropping the hellstorm now. Knows that the lightning straight. strike is coming down. He is gonna be going for 20. Can he get it? Look at these kills. 21, <laughs> 3, 3, 3. What a ridiculous This is 30 how? straight kills for Envy without anyone oh from Enigma God. fighting back. This is just oh. getting bloody. 23 kill streak. This is somebody, the biggest streak we have ever this seen. Man. It's going to take someone pulling his power cord out at the moment to stop him as nothing seems to be hitting Karma as he takes down another two. If this was a pub, he would have a swarm right now. 25 straight kills without dying from are Karma. You, are you serious? Who puts that kind of... This is an international champion of the best teams in the world and he's making it seem like these guys don't even have hands. What is he doing? Dropping down the Hellstorm. Still has the lightning strike. Still has the war machine. He's about to double... That's the only reason he called the Hellstorm. <laughs> Another lightning strike. His third oh! Hellstorm. And he's finally going to be cut down after 27 straight kills, I believe. We already knew that Karma was a brilliant player, but this solidified in everyone's minds that he was someone who would go down in the history books. And that is exactly what he's ended up doing.